Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Before watching the video, please subscribe to my channel. In this video, we will discuss What are altcoins? Altcoins are cryptocurrencies other than Bitcoin, Bcust. They share characteristics with Bitcoin, but are also different in other ways. For example, some altcoins use a different consensus mechanism to produce blocks or validate transactions. Or they distinguish themselves from Bitcoin by providing new or additional capabilities, such as smart contracts or low-price volatility. As of November 2021, there are over 14,000 cryptocurrencies. According to CoinMarketCap, Bitcoin and Ether alone accounted for nearly 60% of the total cryptocurrency market in November 2021. So-called altcoins made up the rest. Because they are often derived from Bitcoin, altcoin price movements tend to mimic Bitcoin's trajectory. However, analysts say the maturity of cryptocurrency investing ecosystems and the development of new markets for these coins will make price movements for altcoins independent of Bitcoin's trading signals. Understanding altcoins. Altcoin is a combination of the two words alternative and coin and includes all alternatives to Bitcoin. The basic framework for Bitcoin and altcoins is similar. Thus, they share code and function like peer-to-peer -peer systems, or like a giant computer capable of processing large amounts of data and transactions at the same time. In some instances, altcoins also aspire to become the next Bitcoin by becoming an inexpensive method for digital transactions. But there are also several differences between Bitcoin and altcoins. Bitcoin is among the first iterations of a cryptocurrency, and its philosophy and design set the benchmark for the development of other coins. However, its implementation has several shortcomings. For example, Proof-of-Work (PoW), the consensus mechanism used to create blocks is energy-intensive and time-consuming. Bitcoin's smart contract capabilities are also limited. Altcoins improve upon Bitcoin's perceived limitations to establish a competitive advantage. Several altcoins use the Proof-of-Stake (POS) consensus method to minimize energy consumption and the time required to create blocks and validate new transactions. Ether, for example, the world's second biggest cryptocurrency by market cap, is used as gas, or payment for transaction costs, in smart contracts on the Ethereum blockchain. As the much-anticipated launch of Ethereum 2.0 has demonstrated, altcoins generally address the traditional critiques of Bitcoin, like scalability and sustainability. By distinguishing themselves from Bitcoin in this manner, altcoins have created a market for themselves. In turn, this has attracted investors who see potential in them as alternatives to Bitcoin. The investors expect a profit as altcoins garner more traction and users and appreciate in price. Types of altcoins. Depending on their functionalities and consensus mechanisms, altcoins come in various flavors and categories. Here's a brief summary of some of the more important ones. Mining-based. As their name indicates, mining-based altcoins are mined into existence. Most mining-based altcoins use POW, a method by which systems generate new coins by solving difficult problems to create blocks. Examples of mining-based altcoins are Litecoin, Monero, and Zcash. Most of the top altcoins in early 2020 fell into the mining-based category. The alternative to mining-based altcoins is pre-mined and often part of an initial coin offering ICO. Such coins are not produced through an algorithm, but are distributed before they are listed in cryptocurrency markets. One example of a pre-mined coin is Ripple's XRP. Stablecoins. Cryptocurrency trading and use have been marked by volatility since launch. Stablecoins aim to reduce this overall volatility by pegging their value to a basket of goods, such as fiat currencies, precious metals, or other cryptocurrencies. The basket is meant to act as a reserve to redeem holders if the cryptocurrency fails or faces problems. Price fluctuations for stablecoins are not meant to exceed a narrow range. Notable stablecoins include Tether's USDT, MakerDAO's DAI, and the USD coin, USDC. In March 2021, payment processing giant Visa Incorporated V, announced that it would begin settling some transactions on its network in USDC over the Ethereum blockchain, with plans to roll out further stablecoin settlement capacity later in 2021. 
Security Tokens Security tokens are similar to securities traded in stock markets except they have a digital provenance. Security tokens resemble traditional stocks, and they often promise equity in the form of ownership or a dividend payout to holders. The prospect of price appreciation for such tokens is a major draw for investors to put money into them. In 2021, the Bitcoin wallet firm Exodus successfully completed a securities and exchange commission qualified Reg A plus token offering and sold $75 million shares of common stock to be converted to tokens on the Algorand blockchain. This is a historical event because this is the first digital asset security to offer equity in a United States-based issuing company. Meme Coins As their name suggests, meme coins are inspired by a joke or a silly take on other well-known cryptocurrencies. They typically gain popularity in a short period of time, often hyped online by prominent crypto influencers and retail investors attempting to exploit short-term gains. For example, Tesla Inc. TSLA, CEO and cryptocurrency enthusiast Elon Musk regularly posts cryptic tweets about leading meme coins Dogecoin, Dogest, and Shiba Inu, which often substantially moves their prices. In October 2021, Shiba surged 91% in a 24-hour period after Musk tweeted a picture of his pet Floki, the Shiba Inu puppy, on a Tesla.6 many refer to the sharp run-up in these particular altcoins during April and May 2021 as meme coin season, with hundreds of these cryptocurrencies posting enormous percentage gains based on pure speculation. Utility Tokens Utility tokens are used to provide services within a network. For example, they might be used to purchase services, pay network fees, or redeem rewards. Unlike security tokens, utility tokens do not pay out dividends or part with an ownership stake. Filecoin, which is used to purchase storage space on a network, is an example of a utility token. Are altcoins good investments? The market for altcoins is nascent. It is an unequal pairing. The number of altcoins listed in cryptocurrency markets has rapidly multiplied in the past decade and attracted hordes of retail investors, feverishly betting on their price movements to amass short-term profits. But such investors do not have the capital necessary to generate sufficient market liquidity. Thin markets and an absence of regulation produce quicksilver volatility in altcoin valuations. Consider the case of Ethereum's Ether, which reached its prior peak of $1,299.95 on January 12, 2018. Just several weeks later, it was down to $597.36, and by the year's end, Ether's price had crashed to $89.52. Yet the altcoin reached record prices of above $4,750 just two years later in November of 2021. Time trades can provide traders with a wealth of profits. Therefore, the altcoin market is for investors willing to take on the outsized risk of operating in an unregulated and emerging market that is prone to volatility. They should also be able to handle stress resulting from wild price swings. For such investors, cryptocurrency markets can offer great returns. Future of altcoins Discussions about the future for altcoins and, indeed, cryptocurrencies have a precedent in the circumstances that led to the issue of a federally issued dollar in the 19th century. Back then, there were various forms and types of local currencies circulating in the United States. Each had unique characteristics and was backed by a different instrument. For example, gold certificates were backed by deposits of gold at the Treasury. U.S. notes used to finance the Civil War were backed by the government. Local banks were also issuing their own currency, in some cases backed by fictitious reserves. That multiplicity of currencies and financial instruments parallels the current situation in altcoin markets. There are thousands of altcoins available in the markets today, each one claiming to serve a different purpose and market. The current state of affairs in the altcoin markets is unlikely to consolidate into a single cryptocurrency. But it is also likely that a majority of the more than 1,800 altcoins listed in crypto markets will not survive. The altcoin market will coalesce around a bunch of altcoins those with strong utility and use cases which will dominate the markets. That's all about today guys. 
If you like the video, then please subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to press the bell icon. See you in the next video guys. Thanks for watching.